in China, my lovely audience. This is Ruhani Bakshi on the behalf of Matrid Technologies, a 15-year-old software and web development company, taking privilege to welcome you to a learning session titled Magento 2 of how to manage customers by creating new customers and customer groups. Well, customers are categorized into different customer groups so that they can be easily managed and they enhance the overall store performance along with unbeatable customer experience. In Magento 2, it's easy to manage customers, but we need to know about two things. First, how to create a new customer and secondly, of how to create customer groups. So let's start with our action now. And for this, we need to dive into the admin panel of Magento 2. Great. Now from here, we have to select customers, right? And under this, just follow the option of all customers. Selecting this will open the current screen for us, which will show us all the customers on our website. Okay? So, to create a new customer, you have to click on the top right corner button of Add new customers. Click on this. After clicking the button, we will get the screen for new customer having two main tabs on the left corner. The first being the account information and second for addresses. Right? So starting from the account information, let me scroll down. We need to type in the basic details of the customer. The first being associate to website. Right now, this will uh, indicate to the website we need to link with. Right, I'm having the option here as a main website only right now. Next, we are having group. Well, which we need to assign to our customer. We want to put it in a general, wholesale, retailer, whatsoever is your requirement. Please select that. I'm gonna select the general group. Right, and moving ahead is the you know, first name, the last name, and the email ID as the mandate parts which our customer are having. You have to just enter them, and rest of the options can be filled as per your requirement. Right, the date of birth, the gender, the VAT number, and each everything. Okay, so for our instance, we're going to take the first name as Nicred. Technologies and the email ID I'm going to take is magento at the rate of metridtech.net. Okay, so this is all the detail I'm going to put. I'll be like the date of birth will be okay. I can take it like 9th grade and this 2000 grade. So I just close it 9. Of November of 2000. Here you go. Great. Next, we are shifting to the next tab of addresses. Click on this. Here we can see a button add new addresses. Right? You have to click on this. Selecting this button will give you the options from which we can type in. The address for our customer, right? The city, the location, and each and everything. And the entered address can be selected as a default billing address or a default shop uh, shipping address or the both. Okay, so you can select as per your requirement. So let me just quickly type in the address for you guys. Georgia Street 5. And the city will be Atlanta. Country is US. Okay. And I'm going to select the state of Georgia. 30305. Phone number is 9814117817. Here you go. Okay. Let's type in the address, and here you can see my address is there. Right? Now, I can select this very address as the default billing address 
and even as default shipping address okay so what I'm going to do next I'm going to save my new customer which is Matrix Technologies by the save customer button just click on this and after this you can see your new customer on the all customers screen you can see and this is the all customers main page and here we have the new customer saved under general the ID the number each and every address right great now next is what we are going to jump ahead and create a new customer group for this we have to click on the stores right and after that under the settings other settings you have to go for the customer group click on this now we can see on the current screen all the customer groups we are having for our store so we can add a new customer group by clicking on the button of add new customer group just click on that now the current screen is having the new customer group having the group information with the two options first the group name right and the second being the text class so for an example I'm putting my group name be like loyal customers give me a moment loyal customers right so I'm going to save it with the save customer group and after that here you can see on the main page of customer groups my newly created loyal customers retail customers on the main page right so next is what next is your turn to add new customers and the customer groups to enhance the overall customer experience and satisfaction for your Magento tool store even if you get stuck somewhere do feel free to get in touch with us at Magento at the rate of metridtech.net magnetize your Magento tool store for your unbeatable customer experience with an easy Magento help have a great time. Take care.